What up, everybody? It's your boy, DJ J. Mathis. Today, we're going to talk about this monster, the RBA T12 LED Echo 3 Pro Photo Booth. And this thing is a beast. Just recently purchased this. I'm going to give you guys a quick walk around and we're going to talk about some things. I'm doing this from my iPad because I didn't want to get it too bright because I am going to do the lights. So I'm doing this from my unboxing room in the basement of my home. It's the room I just unbox things at. But back to this uh, photo booth. When you look at photo booths, you look at the quality, you look at the sexiness, the all around smoothness of the build. And this is one heck of a monster. The photo booth is made of a bunch of different parts from the head shell, two part legs, and the base of it. It comes also, as you see with the LEDs strolling around. Once again, that's one of the reasons why I'm shooting this with my iPad Pro. Once you guys to see it better, I think it's gonna show better than the, uh, my other DSLR that you can shoot videos with. Um, it's, it's a beast, man. And I'm pr proud to say that I purchased this from RBA Photo Booths with Ray and the RBA team. They, they, are, they are amazing group. Um, when you go choose Photo Booths, you gotta look at the smoothness, the build quality, See how the LEDs are up in there? This is the perfect, perfect item. And you also have your knobs to adjust it. Let me step back because this is shooting up pretty close. If you need to, loosen the knob. You're going to be doing this with one hand. Loosen the knob to swing it down, to angle it down. Or to angle it up. Depending on the height of your subjects. You have that option. Um, you also get to choose the color because it comes in a black, it comes in a white, and it's all in all your preference to do. It also comes with this nifty remote which controls the LEDs, which I'm still learning. Have it upside down. Let me go through some modes, some colors. It's a red, I don't know what the camera is showing you. That's a blue. And that's a green, as a matter of fact, let's get the lights. Let's go back through those camera modes again. Excuse the shakiness, I'm doing this with one hand. There's red. Let's see what else we got. There's your blue. There's your green. There's your white. There's a purple. It, it got a bunch. This is auto mode. You change it. I myself goal is to do this with some up lighting and go from there. That's more of a pink. Don't know what it's showing you guys. But this thing is amazing. On a separate separate note, if you purchase this, you also have to purchase the ring light. That's that is the REA ring light, which you can do um, with it. They also have another option. But we get into that a little later. But the ring light works as a beauty light as well. Works as a beauty light. It also works as has a built-in flash in it. It's for it works on the uh, that is the Surface Pro 3, 12 inch. I was told it also works on the Surface Pro 4. I don't have a 4, so 4 will not be going in there. It also has vents for the speakers for sound right there um, you don't have to worry about anything getting hot as to they put enough vents around here so everything in there all the electricity shooting through will breathe correctly so uh, my choice what you see back there is my canon t3i uh, let's get into the back of this Ooh, i'm doing this with one hand y'all see i got this excuse me the back of it is everything. I usually strap everything up uh, to my first photo booth. 
All this will be staying up in there, except for the camera. I'm not gonna transport it with the camera. You see your switches to your ring light for on and off. You see the shutter on the camera right here. Um, that's your test light for your flash. You give you guys a quick test of the flash. Watch the wall. They go to flash. That's just the test of it to show you it's, it's a great flash up in there. Um, I strapped everything down. Keep it pretty much organized up in there. You also have um, this back door, which is still solid for me. Let me just close it right there. You see, it's closed right there, but this comes off. can be removed to hold a 17-inch AOC touchscreen tablet to, uh, you know, so if you want slideshows or so forth going on in the back, it would do all of that as well. Um, it's light back up in here. It's inside at all. It's just gorgeous. You know, it's one of the better products out there. It's a lot of photo booth. A lot of other people with T12 models, but RBA is amazing on their build quality. Shipped to me, this thing came in, shipped in the box at 40 pounds. And so you take away a couple of pounds, maybe one, two, because it was a pretty big box. And it's, it's light, it can be lifted and moved easily by that. Um, you do not have to take the forks off when transporting. They have an alternative for a case, which um, is a two-piece case, or I don't think I've seen a, a hard shell case yet, but I will be looking into that. I'm going off what I've seen, what got me into this. Um, this first hole was, I was told it was added in case you have a short printer cable and you want to come out right there with your printer cable instead of coming out from the bottom. But I have a 15 footer. Um, I'm thinking about getting the, the printer rack that sits right there or a separate one. Um, it's pretty much everything that I wanted in a photo booth. I'm going to give you guys a test run with no printer hooked up. Smile. But that's about it. You know, if you got any questions about it, you guys need to contact RBA Photo Booth um, and the gang over there. Um, find them on Facebook as well. You know it's going to keep taking photos. I'm not going to stop it. Let it go through its color phases. I'm going to leave the link to their website in the bottom of this um, video. So click the link. Go straight to them. You can contact them. You can call them. They will answer any questions you may have, and you will be good to go on this. Once again, this is the RBA T12 LED Echo Pro 3. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all soon.